Let's try another one of these videos. Now we have the front of uh, the bear's face finished and we have the ears finished and here's the back of the head. So we're gonna finish the head. Take the back of the head, uh, right sides together. So you're gonna take these right sides together and pin them. Okay, after I pin these, I'm gonna sew them at a quarter of an inch on the sewing machine. And let's see, I'm gonna try from this angle. Keep getting my hands in the way of these videos. Let's see how I do. Couple stitches forward, couple stitches back, all the way around, quarter of an inch. And this is uh, pieces with the two notches, that long curve around the back. I'm gonna stop so I can take that pin out, all the way around. Once again, I have a curve. So whenever you have a curve, you wanna clip that, otherwise it won't turn well. So we're gonna do that clipping again, where we clip out little triangles. If the curve was going in the other direction, an inward curve, then you would um, cut out, you would just do a clip. You wouldn't have to cut out a little V. So curve like this. Let me cut that a little in a few little places. Now I'm going to press that. Okay. I want to press this open. So take it to your iron and press it open. If you don't have an iron, there is a thing called finger pressing, which I'm doing right now, where you just press it down with your fingers. And that is the second best thing if you don't have an iron. I'm just gonna do that real quickly so that I can speed this up a little bit. Open them up, press them out. Start from this side. Come on. It's not cooperating with me. There. So this is the center back seam of my head, or of the bear's head. Okay, and here's the front. I'm gonna get my camera fixed a little bit. 